We've got a new star season offer 3.24 P2 patch for Evo Kadi, as well as some new updates pertaining to star season. Let's get into this video. Before we get into the video, I'd like to let y'all know that I'm doing a giveaway for the Drake Cutter. In order to participate, all you have to do is be subscribed and leave a comment in any video between now and the end of September. Let's get into the video. All right, guys, before we get into the patch notes, let's quickly go over what we can expect this week. This week on Wednesday, we can expect an update to the roadmap. Hopefully, CIG actually has some new information for us this time around. And this week's Inside Star Citizen is going to pertain to hangars and freight elevators. So I'm interested to see how that's going to go. Also, recently, CIG did a Spectrum post essentially clarifying um what we've seen in the previous isc episode for jump points essentially what they were clarifying is atc is essentially there as border control as well as to control um the fairness in terms of who can jump first um transient jump points do not have atc interaction so you don't have to worry about that and lastly the animation in which the uh ship shoots um a projectile into the jump point is actually not intended so um we won't be doing that once we get our hands in the game that was an older build and uh they didn't intend to have that in the video okay so uh just just uh, an update on that so now let's get into the patch notes okay so for this one is uh pretty straightforward they made some gameplay updates for this one persistent hangers it says it says completed work for shared stowing of persistent hangers this will allow personal hangers to save their state when moving between shards and crash recovery. This is a good update. They've increased the grace period that allows players to tow an own ship to 10 seconds before they receive a crime stat in order to allow them to remove blockages. So this one, there's a few bug fixes for this one. They fixed an issue uh, pertaining to persistent hangers. Uh, do not open when contacting ATC to take off or land at a destination. They fix an issue where a player in a ship flies a quantum jump, an impound teleportation event occurs without a fine and returns the player to the ASAP lobby. They fix an issue where the ATC gate queue message will stack on players in the same instant hangar trapping players in the hangar. They fix an issue where transition between instance hangars and PU is out of order. Stations and rest of PU are out of sync. If it's an issue where you're unable to sell from an auto load order, so now this is pertaining to cargo. If it's an issue where the camera cannot see elevator zone, uh, this area issue inside of elevators. If, if it's an issue where docking or retrieving a ship to docking port at a station, the, the docking arm will not extend. If it's an issue where two long names and extra large anger text will overlap its intended UI space for elevators panels when calling for a hangar. They fix an issue where an automatic doors fail to open in proximity. They fix an issue where tractor beams is not usable inside of the freight elevator area. They fix an issue where sometimes weapons fail to reload if reloading from backpack. They fix an issue where a party launch failed server full error appears or large parties. They face an issue where the size 3 nose turrets of the Vulcan still restricts to size 2 guns despite having size 3 guns equipped by default. They face an issue where a snuff fighter cannot request docking clearance. Now this is for the RSI constellation. They face an issue where the direct message chats after players call cannot be deleted they fix an issue where the objective ui appears twice when the mission is accepted and they fix an issue where mantic core helmet grants additional equipment slots along with this is 10 client crashes two server crashes and a hybrid crash fix before i let you go i'd like to let y'all know that my organization phase one industries is now recruiting new and veteran players if you are interested you can find our discord in the description down below don't forget to leave a like subscribe i'll catch you guys on the next one.